So how'd it happen? Well, the little guy was really moving. He's heading around second, going to third. Julie's like, go, go. I'm like, stay back on second, get back. See, I saw the shortstop catch the cutoff, and I knew Johnny would not make it without some kind of small miracle. Yeah, well? Well, the third baseman catches the ball close to the base, so he decides to slide head first. Oh. Hits his finger right in the kid's mitt, bending the oh fingers back, breaking the pinky finger oh pretty gosh, bad. That's horrible. Oh, poor little guy. Is he going to be all right? Uh, he'll be okay. I mean, it hurt pretty bad, but he's a tough little guy. So we go to the doctor, he puts a splint on it, and away we went. No more baseball for a while. Oh, yeah. You know, plus, we told him, don't slide head first. I mean, the coach and I, we told him and told him that I don't know what made him do it. You know, this is fun and all, and you know what? I, I'm really sorry about the little guy, really. But can you two talk about the marvels of Little League someplace else? Thank you very much. Yeah, we're real happy with how Richie's been doing. Mm -hmm. His whole life has been like a roller coaster. And right now he's at the top. So we enjoy it while it lasts. That's good. That little guy's been such a blessing to us. It gives me that much more peace about tomorrow as well, you know? Oh, that's right. Richie has another surgery tomorrow. You seem to be doing pretty good with it, though. Yeah. Yeah. How's Tyler? Well, he's still having challenges with it, you know? Dealing with all the operations with little or no change. Right. It's hard for him. I think he expects Richie to come out of this operation running and just ready to take on the world. But he knows that's not gonna happen. Yeah. So he hides the fact that I'll never be a normal kid, let alone an adult. I think he finds his own mortality in me. You know, with someone to carry on his name. I think I know what you mean. Doug and I have kind of talked about that a little bit. Really? Yeah, just uh, about Zach. He struggles with it, but uncomfortable. But Tyler needs something to change, because he's just not going to be able to make it much longer. Mm. I'm riding the animal, Mama. I'm riding. You're doing a good job, Richie. We're proud of you. Proud of him, cowboy. Good job, yes. I think he needs a sign. Something that tells him everything's going to be all right, you know? Mm -hmm. Why are you worrying about your boy? You are one of the strongest people I know. Such a good attitude. And You've been a huge inspiration to me, and Zach, of course. You've helped us change to somehow understand why things are the way they are. And I really can't thank you enough. Yeah? Yeah. Well, you guys have helped me out a lot, too. Oh, thanks. Hey, how you guys doing? Hey, how are you? Good, good. How's our little guy? Oh, he is so awesome. He's doing such a great job. How's my little boy doing? I'm having a good mom. You did, didn't you? Yes, you are. So proud of you. Yeah, we are too. He's just, it's just amazing what he's doing, so. Yeah, he's pretty special to me. Look, I can't thank you guys enough. I know it means so much to him to ride something other than his wheelchair. I can imagine, yeah. That was fun. Was that a lot of fun? Did you enjoy it? <laughs> <laughs> Boy, oh boy, did you have an exciting day. Did you have fun, Richie? Did you have fun? Yes, I got to ride the animal, Mama. I know, I was so proud of you, Richie. You know, we have a really big day ahead of us tomorrow again. But we know we'll be watching out over us tomorrow, don't we? We know who this is. Who is this, Richie? That's Jesus, Mama. That's right. We know he's watching over us right now, don't we? Should we say our prayers? Yes, we got to say them. You have anything you want to add, Dad? I don't, I don't know. Um, just a small miracle. How about a small miracle? It would be nice. All right. Let's pray, Richie. Dear God, we thank you for the small miracle you're going to be performing in Richie's body tomorrow, dear Lord. and. We thank you so much for guiding the surgeon hands tomorrow and giving Tyler and me peace, knowing that you're going to be working through this situation for your good. We thank you so much for all the blessings you've given us. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Oh, sir. Hi. 
Thanks, Sarah. Okay. How are you? Good. Hi, Tyler. Hey, good to good see you. Doctor. This is Terry. He was the anesthesiologist during the operation. How's Richie? Yeah, how did he go? Why, why don't we just have a seat, shall we? You're going to be happy to know that the operation was a complete success. We were able to pinpoint the damage and go in and do the necessary repairs. And as expected, it was completely routine. Your boy's fine. He's a real fighter. However, we, uh, we had one small problem. Problem? What? Well, your boy is fine. But we lost Richie during the operation. What? Legally, he was dead. Oh my God, what, what, does that mean? what are you saying? Well, it, well, we got him back. But it was almost as if he decided to come back to us. I've seen a lot of these things in, in the operating room, but this was different. Your boy is different. It was as if there was some spiritual or, or supernatural feeling in the room. I mean, we, we all felt it. Wait, 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 wait. What, do you, what do you mean supernatural? You, I mean, what is this? I mean, did you get goosebumps or did you Tyler. feel a warm and fuzzy inside no, 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 while my son no. was dying on the operating table? What? No, it was nothing like that. We had done everything that we could. For, for, for your son, but we had no logical reason to believe that everything was going to turn out as well as it did. And yet, we felt it. We all felt it. Oh, like, I don't believe this. You're supposed to be a doctor. Well, we are. But there are certain things that go beyond what we can do as doctors. And it went beyond in this particular case. The goosebumps. Well, we don't have any explanation for it. It's feeling something that let us know that Richie was going to be okay. When can I take my son home? Well, he's going to have to be here for a couple of days. He's in recovery right now. He's coming out of the anesthesia. And I, you can probably see him in another hour or so. He's fine. Don't worry about it. It's going to be okay. Come on, Richie. It's Jesus. Come on, who is this, Richie? Come on, you can say it. Who is this, Richie? It's Jesus. It's Jesus. That's not Jesus, Mama. What'd you say, big guy? That's not what he looks like, Daddy. How do you know this, Richie? I've seen him. I've seen him. Face to face. so much for being with us, for blessing us so much with Richie. He's so special. Thank you, Lord. My precious baby. Do you know what this means? I don't know exactly what this means. It, it means... It means that God meant this to happen. For everything to happen to Richie so that you'll know everything's going to be okay. No matter what we think. You know, Sarah, I have not been putting you and Richie first. And, uh, I'm really sorry for that, okay? I mean, after all, we don't, we don't know how long he's going to be with us. Tyler. No, I mean, it's true. Don't say that. It's true, Sarah. I mean, if, if, he, if he hadn't made it through that... That operation, I don't know what I'd do. I, I couldn't live with myself if he didn't make it through. And I, and I don't know what I'd do without Richie. Or even you. I mean, I mean you're, you're everything to me. And, and you've held this family together, you know? And, uh, but I also thought that Richie has a purpose for his life. Yeah, you're right. Tyler, he wants you to stand by the 4.30 meeting. Oh, thank you. Did you just say thank you? <laughs> Where's the normal blankety-blank-blank tell the boss he knows what to do with those papers? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, then. Hey, hey, Becky, do you have a sec? Sure, Tyler. You know, you can always talk to me. I know you never really have before, but... Thank you. Last night, Sarah and I experienced one of the strangest things ever in our life. 
I always thought that I was being punished for something that I had done, that I was cursed, that God turned his back on me and, and, and gave me a son that, a son that just wasn't right. I know that's not the case. Last night, he taught me something. If you know someone that has a child that is developmentally impaired like Richie, or is too young to make a conscious decision, an aborted or a miscarried baby, God is watching over them. They are his children. I want you to take joy in knowing that they are safe. No matter what we think, no matter what happens to them, Jesus is with them. Okay, I feel like in that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, I think I'm almost done here if you want to go get them. Richie. Where's Richie Tyler? Oh my god, my Richie! Oh my god, Richie! Oh my Richie! Oh my Richie! Thank you all for coming here today. Sarah and I, thank you. It, it means a lot. Some years ago, I prayed that, well, I prayed for a small miracle. And my son touched the face of God. Now, he's standing with Jesus. So I have to ask you not to, to mourn or cry for Sarah and I and Richie. Because my son has finished his game. He's made it to home base, and he's cheering us on. And he's saying, come on, Dad. You can do this. You can make it. Don't stop at first or second. Don't get tagged out on third. Make it on home. Win this game because you are victorious. I'm cheering for you, Dad. I'm cheering for you, Dad. Let us pray we can find that same joy and victory to win our game. Let's pray. And Jesus, I just thank you for Richie, and that we can honor him today. And I thank you for that light that you showed me through him, because I would never I could never be the same without him. Thank you, Lord, and I, and I thank you that, that he is up there with you right now, and he is safe in your arms. Jesus, I thank you because you were always watching over us, and you were always there. Thank you, God, for always being there with us, and being there now. In Jesus' name.